So Jada wrote, why do you guys like making illegal probably money? Because man am I lazy? Man, man am I lazy? You see all this, oh, I want to be an entrepreneur and that, yeah? A lot of these guys, yeah, that claim that they want to run their own business or they, came, they claim they're a hustler type or they want to be an entrepreneur is not because they are a natural born entrepreneur like me. I don't want to fully say I am, yeah, because I ain't running no fucking business at the moment. But when I was in school, I was buying and selling crispy drinks. Yeah? That's all I fucking did when I was in school from year eight to year 11, yeah? I even got kicked out of school for that, unofficially, got expelled before study leave and that. A lot of these guys that want to um, claim to be entrepreneurs and that, they, they're not entrepreneurs. They just don't want to have to study for three, four years, get qualified and find a job and have to take orders from anyone. Don't get it twisted. No one likes taking orders. Someone, someone's flagged the live stream. They're probably going to take that out of the live stream in a minute anyway. Um, no one wants to have to take orders from anyone, innit? But at the same time, these guys are lazy. They don't want to have to get up at six in the morning, jump in the shower, um, and, and hit the road by 7.30 to get to work for nine. They don't want to do that. They want to be able to wake up whenever they fucking want to wake up. They're lazy. They don't, they don't want to have to be held accountable for their time or have to get certain things done. They, want to, they just want to drive around and be delivery men, dropping off weed. Now, how hard is that? They just want to weigh up food, bag it up, and go and deliver it. That's all black men know. Deliveries. Whether it's parcels for fucking every, or DPD, yeah, or driving a bus, which means picking up and de delivering people to their destination, or delivering drugs. Black men don't know how to do nothing else, yeah, apart from pick things up and move it, yeah. But we'll pick up it sperm and put it in a woman and then a the child comes out nine months later yeah that's what man black man know how to do is pick up and put down things yeah it's laziness man put the work in man talking about um uber eats is a good job blood would you want your son to work for uber eats Yeah, I, I don't know why the flag, the, the live stream is flagged. Do you rate car traders? I mean, yeah, car trading, that's all right. Yeah. If you want to make money buying and selling cars, do that. Do that on the side, innit? Until you can build up your business to the point where you don't need to work for no one else. But don't, don't go to school and then leave school and think, I'm just going to be a car trader. Because... If it don't work out and that, you're going to be doing that for four or five years and that. If you give up on it, now you ain't got no qualifications, bro. With the car trading thing, yeah, you don't need to be no full-time car trader. Yeah? So you can still go to uni or go to college and that and still do car trading on, 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 on the side. Because what if, you, what, what if things don't go to plan? If things don't go to plan as a car trader, then you ain't going to have nothing to fall back on. At least if you're an electrician or a plumber, you're still always going to be useful to other people. People can hire you. People can't hire you if you're a fucking car trader, a failed car trader. You could get fired from a job as an electrician and go and work somewhere else. If your car trading business don't work out, you're not just going to go and start another car trading business. That doesn't make no sense. So you failed trading cars. So what are you going to do? What, close the business down and then start trading under a different name? No, you're just going to give up on it. Do you rate waste removals business? No. There are people who make big money from waste removals. I don't give a shit. It's not all about the money. Would you want your son to be a waste removal collection man? So your son could have been anything in, in this world, yeah? He could have been an entrepreneur, yeah? He could have been a doctor. He could have been a lawyer. He could have been an electrician. Could have been an accountant, banker, whatever, finance man, IT man, software engineer. He could have been any of those, but he decided to be a waste removal clearance guy, picking up rubbish. No, no son of mine with my last name will be no waste clearance man. No way.